You talk about the neuroscience of habit. What do you mean? Okay, so that this it turns out that that's one part of the relationship between behavior psychology and neuroscience that's particularly well understood. And and there's an area deep, deep, deep in the brain, um, it, it, towards the bottom, the base of the brain, and that's why it's called the basal, for the base of the brain, ganglia, which is a collection of, of nerve cells. And <clears throat> this area of the brain can commonly be called the habit center. Now, the interesting thing to know about this area of the brain is that we share it with reptiles, with birds, with, you know, very primitive animals. And, and what gets wired in there, this is the key point, becomes so automatic that you do it unconsciously. Now, that can have tremendous benefits if you have good habits, because then you do what you're supposed to be doing what without about, having to think about what it. What about repeating the same mistakes? But that's it. But then there that's are insane. bad <laughs> habits. <laughs> and, and, and the problem there is that the brain is running the show, and you're not even aware of it. Never miss a beat. Subscribe to Larry King now and watch new episodes every day.